from the director of the movie Elf, John Favreau brings you Cowboys and Aliens. Cowboys and Aliens is directed by John Favreau and it stars Daniel Craig, Olivia Wilde, and Harrison Ford. Now Daniel Craig plays this character who doesn't really know how he, what happened before in his lifetime before arriving in this town. You know, it's very, very blurry in his head of his, you know, before of everything what happened. Now he has this device on his hand. He doesn't know how he got from, how, what he got, how he got this, and he's trying to remember everything he could. Here now, here steps Harrison Ford who runs with this posse. You know. He's looking for Daniel Craig's character because he's wanted and everything like that, and they want to take him in. And then all of a sudden, as they're about to you know do so, these aliens come in, start taking over the town, and they crash land there and just start blowing everything up like that. Honestly, God, this was when I first saw this trailer of this movie. I the very first beginning, Daniel Craig pops right up. I thought this was another James Bond movie, but you know it wasn't. But when I saw this trailer, I like fell in love with it, fell in love with it immediately. Like this was my most antici anticipated film of 2011, Cowboys and Aliens. I mean, the title says it all. I thought this movie was very well and so done, did very well on so many levels, but it had some flaws. Don't get me wrong. Western and a sci-fi movie put together, which I love because I love westerns. I love sci-fi, and you know, put them together it just makes me happy. Now it stars Harrison Ford, Daniel Craig, and Olivia Wilde. There's none, none of these performances really stand out. You know, no one goes over the top, but Daniel Craig does deliver a good performance. Olivia Wilde, not so much. I was not expecting too much from her, but, you know, I, I wanted to see a little bit more with her, but she was all right. Now, Harrison Ford started out really weak in my eyes. You know, I really wasn't into his character in the very beginning, but as the movie progressed, as the movie went on, he really grew on me, and, you know, he had a couple lines. He had a couple lines that made me die laughing in this movie theater. I was the only one laughing. I could not stop. I seriously could not stop. He'd say the line, I keep laughing, and it's going, the movie goes on, and I'm still laughing. My buddy's like, are you okay? I'm like, I'm not going to be fine. I could not stop laughing. It just made me so happy. These two lines, I'm not going to say what they were because it's spoiler free, but just his two, these two lines just made me crack up. And Daniel Craig, he did a great job, too. He, he was really going for the Clint Eastwood character, and, you know, he... Just about pulled it off. The whole Western, it really does feel like a, a Western. They've been doing really well with Westerns lately. I mean, with True Grit, it, it was really well done. And now Cowboys and Aliens, it really felt like a Western. And it succeeded it succeeded on that level. Sci-fi part, it did as well. And I really liked how the spaceships were on for, with the aliens. And the one crash landed and the ones flying above. You know, they were really these wing type ships. They were really cool. And the effects were amazing as well as the visuals. They the action was over the top. It just really kept you going, and the opening scene was the was really jaw dropping. Like I was just in awe after it because it was it was awesome. The opening scene. Now there are some flaws to this movie. There are many plot holes to this movie as well as they don't really go in depth with Daniel Craig's character, like what happened before. They really just they briefly touch it. They don't really go deep into it, and that's why I was disappointed in it because it was kind of little. You know, it wasn't that they didn't really show too much about what happened before. But other than that, I really enjoyed this movie a lot. I had so much fun with it. Those aliens looked awesome. The everything is so cool. It really it built up to the end scene, and it was just. It was great. I I had a blast. Also, one more thing. I don't know. I may be the only one who thinks this, but it's kind of like on the on the sci-fi side side of this movie. It's kind of like almost a been there, done that before. Because you know, you kind of get the sense of you've already seen this before. You know, aliens crash landing, invading a town. You know, it's been done before. But you know, to cover that up, they throw in the western part, and that's what really makes this movie Cowboys and Aliens. And don't expect much out of the movie. Because I mean, just look at the title. Don't you're not gonna expect too much from a movie called Cowboys and Aliens. But yeah, I really did enjoy this movie. John Favreau did a great job. The cinematography was great. The whole town looked just like a Western movie. It was just, it was awesome. I had a lot of fun. I'm sure you will too. I give this movie a three and a half out of five stars. It was a lot of fun. I will be picking this up on Blu-ray for sure. Thank you guys for watching my review. I hope you enjoyed it. That's all I have for today. So until next time, guys, I'm the Movie Guy, and I'll see you in my next video. Take care.